Good morning, South Florida, and welcome to the Frost Jazz Hour. I'm Tim Smith, your host, and we are so glad to have you here on Thursday mornings at 11, where the Frost School of Music at the University of Miami brings you the very best in jazz. Uh, today we have a group made up of current students and one recent grad, well, actually two recent grads, but we're so proud to have them. Uh, as always, uh, we're, we try to bring you alumni, faculty, special guests, and our wonderful, wonderful students at the Frost School of Music. Today is a group had led by a recent graduate, master's degree graduate on bass, Marty Quinn, wonderful musician, and he surrounded himself with some of the best that we have. So uh, Josh Platt on drums, Cal Schroeder on saxophone, Josh Bermudez on guitar, Leo Folsom on keyboards, Marty on bass, and let's hear some music, Marty.
Marty Quintet. What's that called, Bear Fight, Marty? Bear Fight. Nice. Marty's going to come over and join me. We get to know him a little better today. We'd like to thank our studio audience for coming, especially Justine and Chris. It's always good to have you guys in, in the house. Welcome, Marty. Hey, Tim. How's it going? It's going good. That's a great song. Oh, thank you very much. So who is, uh, who is the guy, composer? So yeah. that's actually a composition by uh, like my best friend in the world, Danny Bauer. Quick shout out if he's listening to the stream. Um, he's from Cincinnati, and he now lives in Chicago. Mm -hmm. And we bonded when I was getting into jazz over like styles of music that we like and everything. And so we're both really into funk. And he runs a band called Safety Squad that I'm going to be uh, going on tour with in December. And so he just recorded an album. It's going to be released and everything. And I love that kind of stuff. It's been a big influence for me. So that was Bear Fight. Well, you had the right guys playing it with you. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. That sounds amazing. Oh, yeah. Really great. Well, Marty, you graduated last year with your master's in yes, jazz did. pedagogy. Mm -hmm. So uh, we are glad to have you be a part of our community and uh, can't wait to see what happens for you next. So are you planning on staying in Miami for a while? Or? Yes, I'm actually, I'm, uh, I'm living in Miami for the uh, foreseeable future. Uh, I really love the people that I've met here and the music that I get to play. It's a very creative space where you can play more traditional straight ahead jazz. You can play um, R&B, pop music. You can, you know, the Latin scene is amazing. And then, um, you know, you can do creative things like this band as well. So I'm a really big fan of the city. It's uh, we're we're really lucky. There's oh, yeah. so much music happening in this in this city. I, I know people that I came here from Nashville, but there's lots of places in the world that have a lot of music that don't have nearly as much as what we have here, Definitely. especially in the live performing side. Mm -hmm. So. It's a great thing. What's what's next for you and your career? What are you looking to do? Just so right now, I mean, I'm taking my master's in jazz pedagogy and I'm sort of building a studio. I, I have more private students now and then I'm looking to play and continue to improve my skills. Um, I've done versions of this group before. I, I, I call this group the Marty Quintet, mm -hmm. five players. Um, and I have done this before in Chicago and then when I lived in Ohio, I did it. But I always wanted to bring it here as well because I mostly play as a sideman and I love it. I love playing everyone's music and supporting that type of stuff. Um, but the best way to do your favorite kind of music is to lead it yourself. And it's also pushing me to compose more and kind of rounding me out as a band leader and a composer. So I decided to do it and I handpicked the guys that would fit the style. I think that they're all incredible musicians. So. Uh, yeah, I'm really happy yeah, to be I, here. I can't imagine being a bass player and leading a band. So. Oh, it's it's terrifying. <laughs> I'm just hiding in the back. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> and as we said, it's it's a quintet. So there's five of you up there. We have Leo Folsom on keyboards. Leo's from Seattle, amazing musician. Absolutely. I've had the joy of working with him a lot. Josh Bermudez, who graduated last year with you, but as an undergraduate, and he's now. Uh, John Hart's teaching assistant on guitar and one of the best guitar players. He's a local Miami kid. I actually played with him in this very space when he was still in high school with uh, Kathy Cousins and Kevin Mahogany and a great, great musician and wonderful friend. Josh Platt and Kyle Schroeder, our saxophonist, both came to us from the Tampa area and we're so thrilled to have them. They're both, uh, are you a junior or a senior, Josh? You feel like you've been here forever. You? Yeah, I'm a senior. You're a senior and Josh is a junior. Okay. So we get both of you, at least you, for another year. But uh, what do we have next? An original, I guess. Yeah, so next we have an original that I wrote a year ago. Uh, it's called Doors Closing, and it's kind of like a dirty street beat. Dirty street beat. Can you demonstrate that, Josh? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's a dirty street beat. Marty Quintet and Doors Closing. Thank you. 
Marty Quintet will be back after a very brief intermission. Frost Jazz Hour, our wonderful musical group today, the Marty Quintet. I'd like to remind you that we've got some great upcoming music here on the Frost Jazz Hour. Next week is going to be a treat for me, uh, a special treat for me. We're going to have Ron Miller and his quintet here. Ron Miller was my composition teacher many, many years ago, uh, and not just me, people like Pat Matheny, Bruce Hornsby. All of the faculty here practically were all students of Ron, one of the great jazz composers in the world, great keyboard player. And uh, he's got quite a group featuring uh, our own saxophone professor, Gary Keller, our drum professor, Steve Rucker, uh, Jeff Carswell, one of my bass heroes, will be playing bass, uh, and I think Tom Lippincott on guitar. It should be an incredible band. Uh, afterwards, we're going to go hang at the Titanic and have lunch, so please join us. We, if we take out the whole restaurant, it's all right, but we, we hope to have a great crowd here for that day. Our studios are located at 2921 Coral Way. Please come be a frequent guest here for the Frost Jazz Hour. We have some people actually skipping class today to be here at the Frost Jazz Hour, so that's including our band, so that's a great thing. Um, later on in September, Professor Chuck Bergeron will be back taking over the hosting duties. He's got Aaron Lebos. He's got the Stamps Jazz Quintet. Alex Brandenburg will be here. We'll, we'll affect with the Sextet. And then our, our dean of the uh, wonderful Frost School of Music, Shelley Berg, will be here on October the 3rd. And he always has not only some great music for us, but he'll be sharing some of the vision that we have moving forward with this group. The next song by Marty and the group is called Bangers and Mash. And if you've traveled the world, you know what that means.
Bangers and Mass, Marty Quintet. My guest now is the drummer you just heard featured on that tune. I don't know if you were supposed to be featured, but you certainly were. Yeah, I don't know. We'll, we'll talk about that later. <laughs> Josh Platt. Uh, uh, Amazing, Josh. You sound you. crazy, you. crazy great. Thank I you. love it. I appreciate that. And uh, I think I heard you the very first day you were at Frost School of Music. You did. You did. You, I played you, with you. You did, and you've gotten better. I, hopefully. That's the way it's, we're supposed to go up. On each of the instruments up here, I could tell you about the lineage of great players on those instruments that have come through our program. But Steve Rucker, our drum teacher, has been here nearly 40 years, and thousands of musicians have come through his program, and some incredible drummers. A lot of whom stay in touch with him, but you're just the next guy. You are sounds sounds great. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Having that. fun at Frost? I am. I am. It's a it's a whirlwind. It's crazy. Especially now starting the new year. But yeah, it's really fun. It put me in a lot of uh, cool ensembles. Last year I did the Latin uh, jazz orchestra, which we did a show here. Mm -hmm. That was outside of my knowledge, but um, I got to work with Daphnis Prieto, who's also a faculty member full-time now. Mm -hmm. um, and then this semester, um, I'm doing this with Marty now, which is really cool, because I love this type of music. Um, I'm also doing another Latin group. It's a small group, so that's going to be really cool, a little more intimate situation. And I'm in the uh, studio jazz band now. We just had the auditions the, yesterday. Was right. it yesterday or the day before? And uh, I got in, so I'm going to be working with uh, the doctor, Dr. Guerra. Yeah, Steve Guerra. So you're going to have a busy life. I am, but that's good. I want a busy life. Well, good. Well, you, you can handle it. I know you can. Uh, th this music, obviously, it takes, uh, th this is not like pulling out two brushes and playing, uh, uh, scrambling some eggs on your snare drum head. This is, you, you've got <laughs> you've got to drive the bus here, and it sounds like Marty's found the right, the right fit for a drummer. You, you're killing this stuff, Absolutely. along with... Everybody, Josh, guitar work is brilliant, as always. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. So the next tune is a Michael League tune, right? Michael League is the bass player, creator, producer, big boss man with Snarky Puppy, and he's, uh, he's a wonderful musician. Uh, he didn't come from the world that we come from. He, was not a, he wasn't born to be a jazz guy. And uh, he is just an exceptional creator and musician, and... Uh, he knows exactly how to drive that band. And, this, and Marty, you remind me of what he does. This is a, it's a great choice of that because it's the way Michael works is very much the way that you work. And Absolutely. It's a great tribute to you. Uh, and what's this called? Flood. Flood. I wonder if it's about a flood. Well, we're in Miami. It could be. It could be so, Miami Beach anytime there's more than 12 yeah, minutes of rain. I'm right. flood right now. You know All right. I mean. Josh Platt, thank you so much. I Thank you. 
So, Marty, we probably got time for one more. What would you like to do? You know, Povo has not been done today, so I think Freddie Hubbard will live. Let's hear one more original of, of Marty's, Northernmost Coast. Again, Marty Quinn and his Marty Quintet. 
Unbelievable music today. So, so pleased with what you're doing, man. Really proud of you. Josh Platt on drums, Marty on bass, Josh Bermuda's on guitar, Kyle Schroeder on sax, Leo Folsom killing it as always on keys. Uh, again, you're listening to the Frost Jazz Hour on WDNA, 88.9 FM, WDNA.org on the net. And uh, be sure to be back with us next Thursday for Ron Miller, a very special occasion here for us here. And uh, you guys, uh, let's say goodbye with this one. Northernmost Coast, Marty Quintet.
Thank you so much for joining us on the Frost Jazz Hour. Perfect time. That never happened.